YouTube, Dawson Rider here with a review of the Deluxe Kiwi Lock Seed from Common Rider Gaim. This is the second Lock Seed that Ryugen gets to transform into Kiwi Arms. Take a very quick look at the packaging. Uh, nothing really that different. You got a picture of Ryugen Kiwi Arms here. Obviously, here's where the lock was. It's got its name and stutch, stutch, and stutch there. And then shows a um, bit of, you know, Kiwi action on the back and shows how Lock Seeds work and then it can function with other things in the line. Oddly enough, um, I haven't been showing the boxes for my larger deluxe items reviews like the belts and stuff. If anybody really misses that, let me know in the comments and I'll add it back in. But I've just kind of been saving time and space since... <laughs> time and space. Anyway, just because, you know, like the boxes for the drivers can take up the whole space and I... I don't know. But if you really want to see them again, let me know. Let's go ahead and talk about the Loxie. We're not here to talk about box dimensions. So here's the Kiwi Loxie. Pretty standard Loxie. It looks pretty neat. You got kind of a, a Kiwi here, which look, it looks like an ancient Kiwi of prophecy on the front here when you look at it. Uh, it's Loxie 13. Other than that, pretty basic Loxie stuff. You got the silver paint here, this um, sort of dark gray plastic. Um, it's one of the locks where you push up here. And that's pretty much the basics of what it looks like. Um, just like all the other ones, it's got an on-off switch here, so I'll turn it on. And it'll make those noises. Um, on its own, without a uh, driver or such, if you press it up. It says Kiwi. Hilarious. Let's listen to it again. Kiwi. Ryugans have got to be the funniest ones. Budo sounds really derpy. It's like, Budo. And this one's like super excited about being a Kiwi. Uh, it's really funny. Um, and then you get the traditional sounds back here with this little button, so... That'll start. There's a you lose one that I always try to get. There we go. It's like, is it so much for me to want to lose? If there's a secret sound in here, it's supposed to remain a secret. Um, so um, now let's go ahead and show its functionality with the Sengoku driver. I already got Ryugen's faceplate all loaded up, so let's go ahead. Kiwi! Kiwi. Alright, and here we go. Whoops. Derp. Alright, now let's do its attack noises. Kiwi Skosh. Kiwi Ore, and... And Kiwi Sparking. So, pretty neat. Um, and then lastly here for functionality, um, I will go ahead and we will show it in the Muso Saber. Just because in the Muso Saber review, I think we got to see everything in it. So... Kiwi power. That's even funnier. So yeah, that is almost forgot to push the button. Pretty much it. Um, as always, I really dig lock seeds. I think they're a lot of fun. Um, so I can definitely recommend picking more up if you are already collecting them. It's always neat to have more, just for more sounds and just more uh, functionality with all your stuff. In particular, I really enjoy the Kiwi one just because I think its voice is really funny. So yeah, if you're collecting lock seeds, I can absolutely recommend picking this one up. It's not like I'm recommending a huge purchase. These things are pretty um, <clears throat> inexpensive compared to most things and are a nice, ad nice added to your collection. I meant to say add, add nicely to your collection. There we go. Dawson can't speak so good. You gooder than me, it make no difference. Anyway, make sure you check out the crazy podcast at RiderAdvantageRambles.com. Till next time, Sauce Rider, signing out.